Hey, it's Josh Vigar from Android Authority. What's going on, everybody? And here we are with the brand new Asus Zenfone 2. This is an update to the Zenfone line from last CES and in 2014 that we actually were very big fans of, mostly because of their price point. But for $200, uh, $200 rather, $199, you do get a 2 gigabyte version of this. We don't know what the price will be for the 4 gigabyte edition, but nonetheless, you still get a lot of premium features and a great experience with this 5.5 inch screen that comes in at 720p resolution and is uh, covered in Corning Gorilla. Gorilla Glass 3. Underneath the surface though, we have uh, choices between among 8, 16, and 32 gigabytes of onboard storage, and the processor is a 64-bit Intel Atom Z3550, or a 3560, depending on which version you get. But it's a quad-core processor that is backed by a Power VR GPU. I'm going through the interface right now, and so far I have a very good time going through all of the elements of the brand new Zen UI that provides a lot more customization and personalization options for you to make this phone truly your own. We have capacitive keys down here on the bottom, but as you can see, the Zen UI has been updated to Android Lollipop, and you can tell already because of not only these cards in the recent app screen, but also coming down in the notification dropdown, you have that particular element to the notifications. A 3000 milliamp hour battery is underneath as well, uh, and you also get, as far as the cameras go, a 13 megapixel rear shooter and a 5 megapixel front facing shooter. As we take a somewhat closer look at the display here, I do want to clarify that the 199 version of this phone will be the 1080p edition at two gigabytes of RAM underneath. This is the 720p edition uh, that does also still have two gigabytes of RAM, but it will come in at a somewhat more affordable price point that they're remaining a little bit hush us at right now. Uh, the four gigabyte edition, like we said, we don't really know the price point yet. They're being pretty hush hush about that one as well. But nonetheless, I do think the 720p edition that we're taking a look at here, especially if it comes in at a much better, even better affordable price point, this is going to be a quite compelling package to have if you're going to get an affordable but high quality device. And Asus is definitely able to do so with the Zenfone line. Uh, Pixel Master is involved here as well as you will be able to use it to get great HDR photos and in low light situations you have photos that they claim are up to 400% brighter. Now, there is also a lot of customization options here with the Zenfone 2. We have here this silver one, but if you look a little bit closely, like I'm showing you right now, there's this hairline brush design on the back that eliminates some of the uh, smudges or the fingerprint magnet that a lot of other phones tend to have with their glossy plastic. But as you can see, this shine right here is really attractive. The button layout on the back uh, allows for the volume to be controlled in this fashion right here. Uh, and the bezel around the Zenfone 2 is actually quite respectable. I do enjoy the design of the Zenfones, especially this one. And considering the price point that you are able to get these phones, I, this really feels like a premium device. And it's something that Asus has been able to do very well in this part of the market, especially with these right here. Uh, I already mentioned that the button layout on the back includes the volume rockers right here, but the power button is also up here as well. And as we go around the device, I really do enjoy what I'm seeing here. The Zen UI has a lot of customization that is available here that bolsters the fact that you can get this phone in a bunch of different colors, even two-toned editions that are available as well. And, you know, we have an app drawer coming around here, all of the abilities that you, that you would expect from the Zen UI that brings a nice premium feeling Android to here and is powered by Intel Atom. So that was just a look at the Zenfone 2 from Asus. It's a great looking phone with a lot of great features underneath at a beautiful price point. You are going to get two gigabytes here. The four gigabyte edition will not come in at $200, but we don't imagine it's going to be way too much more in that particular edition. Nonetheless, you'll have a great experience here with a somewhat larger screen at 5.5 inches that brings all of the nice colors as you can see plainly there on the video. So keep it tuned here to Android Authority for our future review of the Zenfone 2, this great affordable phone. And Stay tuned for even more coverage from us here at CES 2015. This is Android Authority, your source for all things Android.